so in typical yard sale fashion for these swells, um, checked everywhere on the North Shore this morning. I thought the swell might be dropping out a little overnight. Uh, we looked at Outer Reefs, Waimea, Pipeline, because the last couple of swells, it was huge pipe, but it's still do doable. And today it's just a total mess. So made the call, bought a ticket to Maui. We're gonna try to get a session in at Jaws before dark. And uh, yeah, just barely made the airport. Terrible citizen today. I peed in a parking lot and ran over a cone. So you gotta do what you gotta do. You know, <laughs> gotta get there. We made it to Maui. I guess uh, Billy just got a really good barrel. Um, I was kind of freaked out. I guess the wind came on shore. My buddy was doing safety out in the lineup. He's like, as soon as we landed in Maui, he calls me. He's like, don't come to Maui, it sucks. It's like, no. And then we just showed up and the wind laid down and it looks super fun. Got the right board. Actually a brand new board I've never used, but right size. We'll see how she goes. But stoked we made it. See how this like, it's got a flat deck. That, what's different about this board is kind of like the outline going into the nose and it's got a flat deck. You can kind of see the transition. That's so hopefully instead of a somewhat domed deck, your feet feel more planted on the board and in control. And then we got the, the foam all the way up to the top and you get that 70s beak on there. It's just nice to have extra foam under your chest. out is really tricky off of these rocks it can go wrong about a thousand different ways and it can go right only one way um, but even worse than that is coming back in on these rocks because what happens is you try to get on the back of a wave and come as far up as you can where you can hold on to some boulders as they're moving and tumbling they're like this big and it recedes and you run up in theory but if there's too much water it's like up to here it just sucks you back into the zone of abuse and recycles you and your board gets demolished and you're probably hurt. So it's all about timing. It's just going out and especially coming in.
How was it? It was fun, you know? It's a dying swell, so dying swell and just light wind. I have not surfed jaws like that in a long time. It's been windy and rising swell, so it was as casual of a jaw session as I think you could have. And uh, yeah, it was fun. The new board felt great. I was a little wonky and uncoordinated when I first went out, but um, anytime you, you come in feeling positive about the session at Jaws is a win. Because when it goes bad, which it does probably half the times you're here, and you don't surf it for a year, you have that bad taste in your mouth and you're nervous the next time you surf it. So like even on days that like this, if I had fun, like it helps me for when it gets giant on other days. Definitely, it might just be my weird thing, but uh, I found that to be the case for sure. And I didn't destroy my board coming in on the rocks. That's always a win. <laughs>